Hi guys, it's Mina. Welcome back to another nighttime pouring episode. We just finished doing one really cool 24 by 24 indigo ring pour and I still have some paint left and I have a 12 by 12 so I want to play with this a little bit. Uh, I'll show you my colors real quick and then we're going to get right into this. Uh, this one is Amsterdam greenish blue. And this one is my Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics in 24 karat gold. This is Amsterdam indigo which is a beautiful color. This one is Amsterdam Permanent Blue Violet. There's only a little bit left of that. This is the Permanent Red Violet. Uh, this one is Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. And this is Amsterdam Pearl Blue and Amsterdam Titanium White. So, for a 12 by 12, we need about 5.14 ounces of paint. This is an 8 ounce cup, so probably about a little bit more than there, but I don't mind filling it up a little bit more and having a little bit more on there. So let's scoot that over. Let's layer a cup really quick. Uh, let's see, I'm just going to put a very tiny amount of gold in the center. Just a little bit. Literally a little bit. And some of our pearl blue on top of that. And we're going to come in with, let's see, what do we want in the middle? Let's put some of this permanent red violet in there. And I love that with the permanent blue-violet. Those two together are yummy. And we're going to get right into the indigo after that blue-violet. And we're going to put a little bit of the... Let's go back to the pearl-blue. Pearl and some of our greenish blue from Amsterdam, maybe a little bit of gold, and some of our metallic cobalt, and a little bit of white. I'm going to come back to that reddish blue, I'm sorry, reddish violet, red violet, there we go. And see if there's anything left in here. Yes. Okay. That's probably enough, but we're just going to go a little bit more indigo. And greenish blue. And let's put a little bit of gold on top of that. So that's a little bit more than we need for a 12 by 12, but that's okay. I don't mind having a little bit of extra paint on there. Okay. So. That's so cute. It's like a canvas, only smaller. <laughs> I'm just going to adjust this pin just a bit. Make sure that it's sitting straight. Okay. So we're going to get a little bit of gold on there. Right. Okay. All right. Let's do a ring pour. Are you ready, darling? Oh no! You know what I was gonna do? Okay. I kind of want to do um, what I did in Hobbit Trail. And go across. So let's see. Let's put some of this down. <laughs> Are you ready, husband of awesomeness? I'm Alas. Here we go. We're going to do a wandering ring pour and then come back through it. This is a thinner, what I used as my flow extender. I'm going to put that around the edges. Put 
just for some contrast. I'm getting a real Hawaii vibe off of that thing. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to put a little bit of this around the sides. These are actually the same colors. This is literally what I just scraped off the table. Okay, let's spread that out a little bit. So, let's take this side down first. Actually, we're going to go this way first. Should I torch it first? Let's stretch it out mm -hmm. first, then we'll torch it. Okay, so we're trying to maintain this pinkish part right there. That's what we want to keep and stretch out. So that corner is not completely covered, and rather than stress about it, I'm just going to put some of that paint right on it. And I dripped in it. It's okay. Even enough to correct. Okay, but this is beautiful. Let me wipe my hands off <laughs> so we don't do that again. This is another spot on this side. This okay. Corner. I really like what's happening in here. I especially love this. This is amazing, and this is pretty cool. This is gorgeous. Not so crazy about that part, and actually I kind of want to see if I can get some of that bottom off, maybe. Open this up just a bit more. Where's the way to the paint? There. Now we're going to go down. And open these lines up a bit more. Also, we don't want to leave a lot of paint on the canvas. That's pretty cool. I like it. That's way cool. Cool. All right, we're going to torch that. And then we will be done. Awesome. I like it, do you? Mm-hmm. They're kind, let it. <laughs> okay. That's cool. The only other thing that I want to do is I want to take what's in my cup and just kind of give this a stripe right in here. Yeah. 
That's good. I'm almost tempted to put one right in here too. Just really thin. That's pretty good. Be better if it was just a little not so straight. There. Cool. I like that a lot. Awesome. I will show you this one when it's dry. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And uh, let me know if you want to see me do some 12 by 12s or more 12 by 12s. Because I have thought about it. I just, you know, I enjoy bigger canvases partially because there's more time to play. This was over really quick. <laughs> wow. This is so cool right here with that permanent blue violet and that cell. Should we see if we can turn that cell into a heart for Valentine's Day? kind of fun. There you go. <laughs> awesome. Cool. So, speaking of Valentine's, did you guys see my little playing card that I got over there? Get a shot of that HOA. My mystery card that came in the mail with some chocolates and a Valentine's Day card. So, more on that to come very, very soon. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys. I will see you soon. Have a great night. is the rest of our paint left over from our Mysticetti, the blue whale pour. And we did a double wandering ring pour across this one, which was really cool. And gave us these beautiful lines in here. And I just, I love these colors. They're just popping. <laughs> per permanent blue violet up in the corner there with that little bit of the pearl blue. And then a lot of that greenish blue from Amsterdam in there in that corner it's just so pretty and the cobalt metallic cobalt is next to that and with those gold cells popping through is just amazing i really really like this one now we come over onto this corner you guys remember at the end when i put that last little bit of <laughs> to fix the corner up there it turned out very pretty and then we get down here this is the part that was enthralling me when i was tilting it out really wanting to keep it where that uh, blue violet mixed with some of the white and gave us that pretty lavender color and of course those cells now those cells are darker because it mixed with the darker paint so instead of being very very gold like the ones up there at the top these actually have more of like a, a darker sheen to them cast color pigment <laughs> anyways this one turned out really really pretty I like this a lot and up there you see that little heart on the left hand side where we wrecked it to make it into the shape of a heart which reminds me make sure you check out our pour the love collab coming up saturday and sunday february 13th and 14th 2021 it's going to be amazing weekend with 10 epic artists you know just all over the globe actually <laughs> all pouring in a collab which is going to be awesome i think it's the biggest collab ever actually which is kind of cool so anyways thank you guys so much for being here with us I hope you enjoyed this one, and I will see you very, very soon. Have a beautiful day. Bye-bye.